Hello everybody, my name is Craig Bennett and today I'm giving you a sneak peek of my latest project and basically what I'm working on is trying to get a regular TV into a smart TV and also to get the set-top box so you see there direct TV set-top box into something that you can control by your voice by using basic things that you can get online um, so you basically can do as easily as possible what it may be but uh, let's uh, jump on in hey Google turn on my TV All right, let's get harmony. Turning on TV. and you see right there on the bottom left the TV lights and also the set-top box it takes a minute or two for the uh, TV to crank up hey Google mute yeah I'm right there So that's pretty basic stuff, but um, as far as the biggest thing to note is this is a very simple setup. Um, I'm going to see if I can make it a little bit more friendlier uh, with all the things, but um, one of the things I can do is uh, switch channels by just naming the channel. Hey Google, Bloomberg. Oh, right there. Switching to channel 353. And right there where it just switched to Bloomberg. Um, and then I can switch inputs to the Chromecast, which gives extra functionality for Netflix and whatever it may be. So, hey, Google, Chromecast. A second. Hey Google, switch my TV. Sorry, I hey Google, switch to TV. And All right. Here's Harmony. There we go. Switch is back. TV. The thing to notice is whenever I um, go to TV, it goes to Science Channel. Um, I figured out some. Um, yeah, I have it on that as a background noise and whatever it may be. So I can actually tell it to go to a particular channel when it first cranks up or just crank up, you know, normally. But um, with that one in mind, uh, I mean, there's basic things I could do like volume up, falling down and, and other things like that. Um, but with that, it, right now the system is um, not as friendly as I would like it to be. But I figured I might as well show this as a sneak peek. And by the way, leave suggestions on what you would like to see. And, uh, and I'll see if I can do it. And uh, keep in mind, this will, should work with Echo and obviously with Google Home. 